This is Express Collector, and today we're going to be trying to run our Thomas push along once again. So, let's see if he starts. Can you hear that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Get out of here. Hey guys, Express Collector here. Okay. Hey guys, Express Collector here, and today we're going to be taking a look at Trackmaster Lady. Now this is a video I'm very excited about. I will explain how I got this lady, and that'll be as I review it. So, this one I got in that $65 lot, but I was actually going to sell her because she wasn't running. And, uh, here's a look around. I was going to sell her because I thought she wasn't running, and then one day I thought to myself, huh, let me check out some of these engines that aren't running, see if I can get them to run. And with Lady, I kept trying and trying, and I was like, ugh, oh, darn it. So I took the body shell off, whacked it against my desk, put a battery in, and speak the devil, she ran. So, let's go ahead and actually take a look at her. From the front, very nice. Much better looking than the one I currently have. Nice cab windows, the funnel. From the side, do excuse the noise once again. I'm filming on this modified setup. Very nice detailing. I always liked how the cab is just black. In most cases, I cut that out, but I'm not for this one. So, this the golden coupling rods. Her side says lady. Gold dome, golden smoke box. In the rear, you've got her signature lamp. As well as the rest of her cab, which I used to think this was coal, but it's not. And then from the other side, he got pretty much the same lady. And from the roof, pretty basic, pretty simple, but she looks really nice. And then on the underside, not much else to see there. It's a Hit Toys lady, which is pretty nice her face. So that is Lady in a nutshell. Now while she's a hit towards when she does not have the annoying middle wheel. Thankfully. So go ahead and open her up. Which is just pinch the tabs and off comes the body shell. And here is the underside. So as I told you guys I actually just took her and bah, bah, just smacked against it and she started running. So we're going to go ahead and grab a battery. Which I have Right here. Straight it right there. I think that's how. Now she is a bit loud, but she's actually quite smooth as a runner. So I'm just going to put her back together. Squeeze. Oh, this is very hard to do one handed. There we go. I think. That should do it. Very fast. So I'm going to give her a train. And we're going to go ahead and give her first run. So. For Lady's first run. I'm going to have her pull my little push along Thomas. Now sadly I do not have a push along diesel 10. I don't think that exists. But if it did he'd be right here. So. Trackmaster Lady. First run. Okay. First run. She's going really quickly around this little loop that I have set up. Let me see if I can rotate it a little bit. There we go. Back up the camera a little bit more. Ah, yeah. That's more like it. She runs very quickly. Very nice. For those of you wondering, I do have plans to use her in my series, so she's not going away anytime soon. Hmm. 
Looks like she's done a nice job with Thomas, so I'm gonna stop her here. And now she is a special engine. She's gonna get a very special load. The royal carriage. And off he goes. So there you have it guys, Packmaster Lady. Very nice little model, I definitely recommend you get one if you can find one, even for a low price. If you can see one at a low price, you gotta pick it up. It doesn't matter if it works or not, just, just get yourself one. Don't worry, I don't need any more, I have two. <laughs> so that's gonna do it for this video, I mean, I hope you all like this video, and the little um, beginning section that I threw in there. Uh, so that's going to do it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Feel free to click down below to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in my next video.